Hello everybody, welcome back to That's Joe Games. Now I know you're thinking, Joe, this isn't this is not a game. And you're right, it's not a game. But I thought we'd do this little quiz. Quiz is still kind of counts games, and it? it's it's sort of a similar thing. Who knows? Who cares? Now I'm gonna find out today how evil I am. Because a lot of my friends, if you ask a lot of my friends, they will tell you that I am quite evil. I'm like an evil little well, Mikey calls me an evil little dwarf. But I don't think I am that evil. But then again, maybe that's what an evil person would say. I don't know. Either way, I thought we'd do this quiz uh, that I found on the internet to find out. Because that's how you do find out if you're evil. You don't, you know, you don't go to like a psychoanalysis person. You just type it on Google and figure out if you're evil or not. So without further ado, let's get on and find out if I'm evil. <laughs> <coughs> Have you ever been happy to see someone fail? Yes, no, maybe, big time. I don't know anyone who has failed. Pure joy. Now this, right, I don't know because people that aren't very nice in the world, when they try and do something and fail, it's quite nice. Like, for example, Kim Jong-un, when he tried to do a uh, nuclear test and it didn't work or something. Like, that's an example of a time where I like to see people fail. Do you know what I mean? But other than that, no. So I'm going to go with no. Which of these foods would you be most willing to share with someone? Chips, a banana, I wouldn't share a banana, who shares banana with someone? Unless you give them the skin, but that wouldn't work. Popcorn, chocolate cake, absolutely no way. Ice cream, no way. Steak. On a steak, I don't like the fat on a steak, so I always leave that and say, look, if anyone wants the rest of this, you can have it. Thing is, I'm the sort of person, I'm the, if you know me, you will know that I'm a very, very slow eater. So I'm more than happy to share chips with people, probably more so than popcorn. Although popcorn is the ultimate like, sharing thing, in it. I would probably share... I mean, I wouldn't share the nice bit of a steak. I would go with chips, because I find chips quite boring. As I'm just, that's quite controversial, but I find chips quite boring. I always eat the burger first, or whatever it is first. Chips go last, and usually I fill myself up on the chips, and I've got loads left over, so I always share the chips. Pick a food to throw at someone you don't like. <laughs> okay. Would I throw a hot dog, meatball, I'm guessing, a banana split, cheese. Is that cheese or spaghetti? I can't tell. The one next to it's spaghetti, so I'm guessing that's like stringy cheese. Or a steak. Um, I would throw, if I had to throw something, I would just, I would ping a meatball. Because they're, they're easy to throw, aren't they? <laughs> they'd, they'd splat as well. Oh god, I think, I'm, I think maybe I am a little bit evil. <laughs> Which hamster is the most confident? Um, the one that's... Hmm. The one that's obviously on like two feet. Do you know what I mean? Or maybe the one that's in the basket, but then he looks quite scared. Confidence is the sign that you're eating. Do you know what I mean? He's eating. That's kind of a sign of confidence, I guess. Is it? I don't know. I think this boy here, he's on two feet. He looks like he's sort of... I don't know, he just looks proud. He looks more, more proud than this one on the left. I'll go with this one. I don't really know what I'm talking about. Which squiggly line is the best? I mean, I would go for... I like this one. Because it reminds me of Harry Potter's scar. Do you think animals have souls? Yes. Only dogs, maybe. Only dogs... No one has a soul. I'm confused. A soul... I mean... I'm tempted to say only dogs. But that would be stupid of me. I'm gonna go with yes, they do have souls. Choose a phrase to yell, hello daddy, no I would never say that, I'm the best person, no, let's take a rocket into space, five chickens is too many, is this shampoo or conditioner, don't underestimate me Susan, don't underestimate me Susan, oh here we go, that's the end of it, that's literally the end of the game, you got 1% evil, you're just a teeny tiny bit evil, well that's great, I'm only a little bit evil, so put that up your ass, Mikey, and everyone else that says I'm an evil little dwarf, because I'm not, clearly, <laughs> let's move on, let's find some more quizzes to do, Pack your lunch for school and we'll give you a teen movie to watch. Choose a main course. Sushi rolls, cornflake crusts and peanut butter and jelly sandwich. I mean, that's that's very American, that one. Chicken salad. I just realised this font is the sort of font that I use for my thumbnails. Chicken salad. Caprice panini. Oh, I do like that. That sounds good. What's this for? Main course. Uh, lettuce wraps or a turkey sandwich. I'd probably go for a caprese or caprice. Caprese. Caprese panini. Choose a side. Salad. Hummus and chips. Veggies. Baked chips, apple, fruit medley. Well, for a side, you wouldn't have an apple as a side, would you? That's a bit weird. Um, I would go for... I'll go for veggies. I'd be healthy in, the, in this situation. Pick a treat. Granola bar, cookie, pretzels, brownie. This is making me really hungry. String cheese or yogurt. For a treat, I love a yogurt. I'll go yogurt, please. Choose it like a muller corner. With a little banana one with the little chocolate flakes. Oh, God, that's making me hungry. Choose something to drink. Water, cap Capri Sun or Capri Sun, if you're weird. Milk, Gatorade, Le... Le Le Croix, Le... isn't that the woman who sang that? I'm going in for the kill. No, that was LaRue. Soda. 
I'm not gonna lie, this sounds bad, but realistically, I would go for water in this situation. Maybe a Capri Sun. I would treat myself to a Capri Sun, because I had vegetables, so I'll go with a Capri Sun. Or a Capri Sun. What will you freshen up with? Altoids, Juicy Fruit, Lifesaver. I mean, I don't, I've already tried one of these Lifesavers. They're like giant polos. They're not great. I didn't like them. I don't rate them at all. Juicy Fruit, the flavor goes after like a second. Tic Tacs, I love the smell of it inside a Tic Tacs box. Or straight mitts. I would probably go for Altoids. I like the, 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 the cinnamon ones. Oh, they're good. I'll go for an Altoid. Finally, choose something to pack it in. <laughs> I would go with a rucksack. Or a bread. That, that's kind of cool. That's very uh, urban outfit, isn't it? That brown paper bag. I'll go with that. You got Alex Strangelove. What is... What? Who is that? I don't know. I don't know. Okay, right. This colour test will reveal which Disney movie you should watch. Pick a red. Okay, got to choose a colour red. I like a dark red like that, like a burgundy red. Oh, lovely. Pick an orange. I mean, sorry, how is this because of like there? It's basically going to be the Lion King, isn't it? You get the red and the orange with the video cassette. That's what I reckon. I like... Let's go... Let's go Easy Jet Orange right there. Bang. Pick a yellow. That's I mean, that's not yellow, is it? That's like lime. This one. Pick a green. I like a forest green, definitely. Pick a blue. Uh, this blue. That's literally the same colour my bedroom walls were painted once. Pick a purple. I mean, pfft, I like this purple. Pick a pink. Is it, this is random. How is this even a thing? Uh, that's more of a lilac -y colour. Let's go with a lilac. You got the princess and the frog. I've never seen that. I've never seen that film. Ever. Maybe I should watch it. That's what it is. It just suggests a film. How does that... Like, where's the science in this? Buy some clothes and we'll give you a Netflix original to binge watch. <laughs> okay, right. <laughs> Netflix is growing. Yeah, too right. It is. Pick a dress. Okay, I'm going to go with what I would... If I was going on a date and the girl I was meeting up with, what I would be most happy to see her in. I think this one's nice. That one. Pick a top. Let's go with... This one. <laughs> Pick some beachwear. It's like The Sims, isn't it? Um, oh, I don't know. I would go for either one of these two. Oh, that's quite cool. That's cool, isn't it? We'll go with that one. Pick a skirt. It's Pocahontas skirt. We've got the biker skirt. We've got that. I'll go with that one. That's nice. Pick a jacket. The leather jacket. I think, I've no I think I know that girl. I recognize those necklaces and buttons. Pick an accessory. Uh, sunglasses. What even is that? You can basically see her nips behind the behind the jewels, I guess. One of these things, which you wear when you're like seven. No offense, Urban Outfitters. I've just read that, sorry. <laughs> or these. I'll go with these. They're cool right now. Pick a pair of shoes. I would, I like these ones the best. You got in the Innocence. <laughs> but I'm pretty sure that you can't even watch that on UK Netflix. I just realized I'm on BuzzFeed.com and not on BuzzFeed UK. Sweet. <laughs> Pretty sure that's not on there. Is that on our Netflix? I'm, I don't think it is. Hold on, hang about. Right, Netflix. Oh, we do get it! Runaway teen lovers June and Harry find themselves swept up in a dangerous and confusing new world when June begins to display mysterious abilities. 95% match. Well, there we go. How many episodes though? I ain't got a lot, I ain't got a lot of time. Oh, only one season. That's fine. Eight episodes. Doable. All right, I'll do that tonight. Anyway, guys, there you go. There's a few quizzes that I went through. Hope you got to learn a bit more about me from that. Like, what I'll be watching later on today, probably. <laughs> anyway, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you want to see more of these ridiculous quizzes. But also, very entertaining and enjoyable. Let me know in the comments below if there's any more quizzes you want to see me take part in to find out a bit more about me or, like, or how I'm gonna, how I'm gonna die, like, those kind of ones. And I will see you very soon with another video. Cheers. Goodbye.